This is my inspo photo, but this is what we got so far. Oh my god! And now, oh, good morning and happy June 25th. Look at me being all healthy, not having coffee and having a shake. Oh my God. I just started having shakes recently and I feel a bit better because I'm not having fast food. I'm not throwing out plastic. And I'm also trying to cut down on my coffee, but it just doesn't hit you the same way coffee hits you. You know what I mean? So remember the time that, the millions of times that I said I was going to do my thing. We're doing it right now. So my friends Trisha and Holly are here and we're, we're going to try and design this ish. This is my inspo photo. I want like bags, picture frames, like sunglasses on little thingy magic. Like, I think it's so cute. Okay, I have so many candles. We had to store the candles in a box. And we still have like all of these. I kind of want to like stack them. And I also bought these for the shelves. I have like all of these plants, like these little succulents, these little box, a pencil holder, candles. Because I need more candles. Okay, oh my god, guys, Lola just came back from a walk and she has a piece of grass like stuck in her butthole And I don't know how to get it out because she won't let me. Lola, this is awkward for both of us. Lola, Lola, come here. I know it's awkward. Ooh, 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 ooh. Stop biting your tail. Where is it? Ah! You poop on you, Lola. Don't throw your butt on me. Oh my god. <clears throat> Lola, why was it in your butt? Did you see it on a blade of grass? Did it go up your butt or did you eat the grass? That's what I want to know. <laughs> Blue. <laughs> you never have this problem because you have a short tail so I just wipe it. Lola, on the other hand, has a big tail. Okay, back to the shelves. I feel like with shelves you have to like even out everything. Like in the Sorry Girls video they did like the rule of threes. So they kind of like spread everything out in three sections. Like the books here, the books here. I mean we don't have other books but like everything's like spread out. Even the boxes are all spread out. The bags are all spread out. Let's do this. We're all like just looking at it and seeing if anything needs to be changed or anything needs to be like tweaked. But this is what we got so far. It's definitely better than it was before. I'll show you guys before. What do you think? You like it? Does it look good? Oh, okay. Thanks. Uh. <laughs> Y'all know what that is. Glam time. my hair. Blue had her little debut. She was in it. Now we're gonna go take some EOS photos. Girl, these EOSs are so <laughs> cute. Like, they're so cute. They're like mix and match like pastel colors. I'm like, oh my god, I'm so excited. I'm so happy that they chose me to do this. We're taking it in Trisha's car because <laughs> hers is white and aesthetically pleasing. We want to have like, okay, here's the inspo photos like outside the car, inside the car, applying the lipstick or applying the EOS. Like, this is the inspo. The EOS pics. I think they turned out super cute. I'm like, but kind of like your friend Andre or whatever. I think Sierra took one picture like out of her car one time at Big Bear and I was so jealous because the photos look so cute, but it's very similar. You're also on my car right now. Hi, Smelly. Oh, where'd she go? Oh, bye. I don't think so. We do not run outside of the house in this household. Bum, bum, be dum, be dum, bum, be. I will never, ever, 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 ever be your side chick. I was it's okay, you're ready. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Lola! No brushes. Stop it. I'm so happy with how the shelves turned out. I mean, it's not exactly like the Tara girls. Like, it's not like perfect. You know what I mean? Like, hers is. But I think it's perfect in my heart. You know when you have a baby, it's a little bit ugly, but you're like, you're perfect in my heart. That's how I feel. This is my baby. I think one thing that's kind of throwing me off is like the amount of colors there are. Like, there's like green and yellow and like pink and like blue and stuff like that. I think in a perfect world, I would just have like neutral colors, but we still love her. She looks pretty cute. We finished taking like a lot of photos. And that's why I feel like I've changed outfits like 27 times in this video. Um, because this one that I wanted like a loungy photo. But 
But I'm about to go and see my friend Rachel. Her, her username is Rach Loves on YouTube. And we're about to film a video together. I'm so excited. I don't really know what I want to do on my channel, but ah! I'm really excited. I feel like me and Rachel always do a video like every single year. We, I, we should have like a freaking playlist of how many collabs that we've done in the past. And I'm like so excited for her for having her. Oh no, where did I put her palette? No, where is it? We were using this as like a step stool because I don't have a step stool. I mean, we do, it's just in the garage and we were lazy. <laughs> I have to put this back. Okay, I'm not even gonna lie. I have no idea what I'm gonna film with Rachel. And I'm like freaking out a little bit because I know that we could come up with something on the spot, but I'm like, should I bring anything? Thing. This is the 27 millionth outfit of the day today. <laughs> oh my, I literally just realized my whole outfit is from Halster. I literally hate myself. <laughs> I mean, my belt is from Girls Winning Girls, Adeline Oh, ah! oh um, I guess my necklace is from Amazon. Boop. Okay, I decided what I want to do. I want to do letting the person in front of us decide our food, but Canada version. So we're going to go to like Tim Hortons. I think Wendy's is Canadian. Is it? I don't really know. All right, you got everything? You can't come, but come on. There you go. We're blocking off the studio so Lola doesn't eat my brushes. It is kind of my fault because my brushes are on the floor. I'm gonna bring my Starbucks cup just in case we go to a Starbucks and there's a Starbucks near her. I'll get one for her too. I'll see you stinkies in a couple hours. I love you. I made it to her house. I feel like no matter what, like whether I'm in Toronto or whether I'm in LA, it's always 30 minutes to get somewhere. It's cause LA is the traffic and Toronto is just like everything so spread apart. <gasps> I just want a condo in Toronto that would be like, ah, oh, the dream. That's the ultimate dream, putting it out to the universe. Universe, please, I want a condo in Toronto. Hello. Hey. Not my kitchen. It is someone else's kitchen that you may know. Hey. <laughs> oh my gosh, I completely forgot to vlog with Rachel, but we filmed like an entire video and we got all these cameras, so it felt like I was vlogging, but really, I wasn't. But we took some really cute photos and I'm taking home a whole, look at this big brownie. We made brownies and it's gonna go on her channel, so. And they taste so amazing. It's like caramel chocolate brownies and they are literally what heaven tastes like. When you go into heaven, there's clouds, you haste cloud, that is what it tastes like, this brownie. So I'm gonna head home. I have to gas up, but yes. All right, I'm back in my studio. I'm all packed for Ottawa tomorrow. I just need my tripod. It's the next day. If you're like, Adeline, why do you wear the hoodie every day? It's cause I do and it's so comfy and it's in like an extra, extra large. And I'm like obsessed with this hoodie and I think it looks really good with the yellow and I just like, I always grab it for pajamas which is really gross and disgusting. But I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog of us redoing my shelf. Sorry, my, all my lights are off because I was like about to go to bed, but I was like, wait, I need to finish the <laughs> outro really quick. But I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog. Today's tip of the day goes to sweet fashion look on Instagram. She's wearing her Beep Bop crew, which there's only a couple sizes left of the Beep Bop crew, like almost everything of the Girls Sporting Girls sweaters. We're getting rid of everything and bringing in brand new products that I'm so excited about. We have a really exciting like one year launch, which I am looking forward to. And I keep looking at I'm like, we need a launch it too, like, because it's super late. And then today's tip of the day, it goes to Jane the Medrano on Instagram. Her tip of the day says, at the end of the day, we can enjoy it much more than we think we can. And I love this tip of the day because I was just like thinking back to it. So basically, I was thinking about my laser hair removal and every time I go in, I'm like, oh my God, this is so scary. Like, I don't think I could do it because you're lasering your armpits and your legs and your vagina and everything. And then you actually get to doing it and you're like, oh, this isn't that bad. I feel like a lot of the things we build up in our head and it isn't actually that bad when we're actually there. Like, especially when I'm about to go on stage to do whatever, I get really nervous right before, but on stage I'm like, oh, this isn't even that bad. I feel like that goes for a lot of things. But today I just uploaded my social media is ruining your life when you don't even realize it video. And everyone in the comments is like making my day. You're, you guys are all like sharing your own stories and complimenting each other in the comments. And I love that nobody is ever bashing each other. It's just everyone coming together and just spreading love. And I don't know, that's just, it makes me so happy to see that in the comments. Cause I feel like us Adel Angels, we are literally the most positive, like best fandom on the internet. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I'll see you guys in my next daily vlog tomorrow where I'm gonna be going to uh, Ottawa cause we have some exciting things for girls support the girls. You guys remember when I had a breast cancer hoodie like way back when, literally November. So I tried to get like a publicist to do this where I like set up an event and we we're able to donate with like this huge check. You know, like when people donate with like a huge check, I have always wanted to do that. And it has like blue stuff on it. Wait, let me show you. We have a couple extra over here. I have always wanted to do a donation thing with a huge check. Ah! 
It has always been a goal of mine. And the fact that it says girls supporting girls on it and the fact that you guys did it by buying the merch and a percentage of every single merch item sold goes towards the, the charity. I'm like so excited about it. I'm so excited about tomorrow. I feel like it's just gonna be a lot of good energy. And a lot. another thing that I wanna do is I used to donate like month by month to each charity. This year I wanna try doing like every six months I donate to a charity. So a portion of every sale still goes to a charity but I wanna collect all the money over six months and do a big donation over six months. You know what I mean? So if you guys have any charities that are near and dear to your heart, I kind of like it to be girl related because it's like girls supporting girls, but it doesn't necessarily have to be girl related. I think I tweeted out like what are some charities that are near and dear to your heart. So if you guys can respond to that, I was like reading a ton of them, but I'm so excited. I love my company, Girls Supporting Girls. I love being able to do this stuff. This stuff makes me so happy and so inspired. And I like don't even think I'm going to be able to sleep tonight. Like I'm so excited and I'm a little bit nervous. Like I don't really know what to expect, but you guys will see the vlog tomorrow, but I love you guys and I'll see you guys on my next day the vlog tomorrow. Same place, same time. Love you guys. Bye. Hopefully I see Elle Mills in Ottawa. She's in Ottawa. Bye. Bye.